There are many examples of testing here that could be given, but this is what one we've got here. Uh, what I've got here is a piece of um, uh, braided uh, wire, uh, coaxial cable, in fact, without the outer braid on, and we've got some artificially introduced uh, damage uh, in, on the braid in two places. Now, the coil is basically a differential pair, so two coils wound around the thing comparing adjacent areas. Um, this is a 5 kilohertz to 50 kilohertz. I'm just using 15 kilohertz. That's the bang in the middle for kind of frequency. Um, and then I put the coil in the thing. I've set it. It's got a 1 hertz high pass filter. Um, and what you've got here is a time based display. That's the end of the wire going in. So we go through the wire. I've set the noise that comes from the surface, which is caused by the braiding itself, horizontally. And then we get a defect, and that gives a, a kick on the display. And then we keep going up, there's another one up here. And then basically the idea is that the main part of the braid is set horizontally, doesn't trigger the alarm, whereas the other two do. Uh, and that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, Coils available in a variety of sizes. You can use absolute or differential. Differential is preferred to find defects. Sorting is better with absolute. Uh, and kind of make coils up to 180 millimeters diameter. This one is uh, 2.6 millimeters. I'm going to go down, test everything from wire to tube, up to bar, etc., in non ferrous materials for surface defects and if the frequency is low enough, internal defects as well. On this display, there's an alarm. Uh, we can go in and adjust the alarm. Uh, probably the easiest thing might be to do is to go and change the edges. I've made it 100% left and right. Uh, we could bring that in a little, say to, uh, I don't know, let's make it 40. And Bring this down a little and make that 40 as well. So that's 40 40. Um, so this is the noise from the braiding, the hum from the braiding, and then that's the defect going up there. So we've now, I mean, if you like, kind of improved the Because time based to play is also showing what's kind of going on. And that's basically we so we phase the noise from the braiding horizontally earlier on, and the defect comes up. Nice, good separation, 90 degrees.